You got a lot of nerve coming in here after what you did. Well, I didn't know that your dog was also your sister. Well, you know how we have to settle this, don't you? Hi, my name is Ted with Legacy Brown Leather. In this video, I'm going to be crafting a leather playing card case. Now, I understand that this is rather unnecessary, but I've wanted to make a playing card case for some time now. And I was trying to figure out a unique way to do this without any stitching or without any wet molding. So this is what I came up with. So let's get to it. For this project, I'm using some Wick & Craig medium brown harness leather, three to four ounces thick. Then I place my template on the leather and give it a rough cut. From there I'm just tracing it out with my scratch all. Once that's done I'm using a straight edge and a knife. Then I just use my rotary hole punch and I punch out the holes. And here I'm using my number one Palo Santo edge beveler to bevel all the edges, top and bottom. And now I'm using one of those acrylic felt tip markers filled with brown edge dye to dial the edges. And here's another felt tip marker with some tokenal split with water 50-50. Then I just burnish all the edges with the rotary dremel tool and a cocoa bolo wood attachment to give a nice shine. And here's where I'm going to give the case some shape. Since I'm not wet molding this, I'm using a straight edge and a bone folder to get a nice crease. Then I just repeat the process for all the creases that are going to be on this case.
Now I'm just adding my logo to the back of the case. Since three layers of the leather can get kind of thick, I'm using a French edger to thin it down a bit. And now I'm just installing the button snap. And here's a test fit. It's going to be snug at first, but that's to be expected. Not too bad, but let's check out some B-roll. Thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you want one of these playing card cases, they will be available in my online store. For now, there are gonna be five of them available as a small batch run, so go ahead and snag one before they get taken up. I'm on Instagram, at Legacy Brown Leather. Go ahead and give me a follow there. I post product photos, process photos, and general rugged vibes. Head to patreon.com forward slash Legacy Brown Leather if you wanna support my channel. If you like this video, please hit that thumbs up and please subscribe. This shows me that you wanna see more videos and more content like this. I will see you in the next video. Stay safe out there. You got a lot of nerve coming in here after what you did. Well, I didn't know the hamsters could attend college. I didn't know that vampires had to be invited inside. Well, I thought those werewolves were looking for a good time. I didn't mean to set fire to that chicken. I didn't know those were your donuts. That was my first time seeing an alien. What would you do if you saw Bigfoot? Well, how was I supposed to know she was a Yeti? Their coffee was quite hot. Well, how was I supposed to know it was my turn to do the dishes? Well, 